Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you on how you can select an element behind another element in Canva. If you have a really complex design with a lot of different elements and some of them might be overlapping another, then it can be very challenging to select that element that was hidden or blocked behind the other bigger element that was positioned on top of it. So, uh, fortunately, there are two methods you can uh, mitigate the issue. So, let me show you how. Okay, first, I'm going to insert some objects. It could be any object, it could be uh, any image. It will work on video, shapes, vector graphics, etc. I'm going to insert some elements just to show you on how you can select them even though they may be positioned at the back of the other object. So I'm going to insert this triangle, circle, and square. Now I'm going to change the color. Let's say the triangle is going to be red, the circle is going to be green, and the square is going to be blue. And let's say I'm going to put this element there basically blocking one another so as you can see i cannot click on the triangle nor i can click on the on the circle i can only click or select the square now uh, one way to click the other elements that was that was hidden is you can press and hold the control key on the keyboard if you are using mac then it's going to be the command key and after that you can click on the element on this square and you will see the color change it means that we are clicking or we are selecting a different object now and do it again you can see the color change now we are selecting the triangle you can click again it was the background but now we are uh, circling back to the square and then we go to circle and then eventually triangle so that's one way to do that but probably this is not very easy because we cannot see what is being clicked although it's very useful but i still don't think it was intuitive for a lot of people and that's why i do recommend to use a different approach so what you can do is you can click position and you will see on the layers tab here you will see different objects you can click on every single one of them and basically it's going to make it easier to move an object that was located behind another object I do recommend this layers option because you can see the visual cue of, about the object that is being clicked or being selected. But anyway, that's exactly how you can click an object behind another object in Canva.